going on YouTube? My name is John GXP. I'm doing a quick uh, review on something I was very skeptical on adding to performance to my vehicle. It's called a performance chip. It's actually called chip your car um, right here. Let me auto focus it here. Yep, it's chip your car. Um, it comes in this little box here and it goes into your uh, OB2 um, port. Um, this device here was um, about 230 about 230 um, and the numbers it claimed to be able to um, obtain is up to like 60 plus horsepower um, about I think 5 uh, mpg you save in on your gas mileage uh, I just wanted to see what all the height was about so I went ahead and risked it so I wanted to do like a update with guys who might be out there <clears throat> you know looking to add one or buy one and I wanted to give an honest legit review on one and to actually give you my full thoughts about it so pretty much what it is is um it goes inside the like i told you the port here at the bottom of your car um i'm trying to show you how it looks i have it already plugged up i already synced it and everything so i mean i'm kind of late on uploading the video as far as the steps i did but uh this is like part one actually of me doing it i just did it but it it goes down here I got it plugged up here and all the lights showing here pretty much that it's working. So you pretty much plug it in here. You let it sit for a couple of seconds. It's set up to like 10 seconds. And then um, you hold the sync button for about uh, 20 seconds. Excuse me, about 10 to 15 seconds, it said. And then um, you got to drive up to like 150 miles for, I guess, to fully, you know, register your car, know your car, program it, everything and to see now uh i recently did prior to putting this on my gxp was doing zero to 60 um and about you know the best time i got was like 6.3 seconds 6.2 seconds and um uh that's that's how and that's how i provide i will uh, advise you guys to do to do all your timings before you put it on to see if if anything now just the small things I noticed because I haven't drove 150 miles yet. Now, I can notice some type of improvement as far as like in my higher gears, like second and third gear pulls do feel a little bit sharper versus before. The throttle response is very touchy. Like if I were to touch down on the pedal prior to it, it's more of like a sluggish feel before it builds up for that power. You know, when it get close to like maybe 4,000. 4, maybe 35 to 4,000 RPMs before you really feel that power. Now it's like just by the, you know, first 20 miles, I'm, I'm already noticing, um, you know, um, uh, different, it's more power in the power bands on different gears, like second, third gear, actually any gear I go into, um, it, it's like immediate power. It's like instant. So I want to, you know fully getting an idea because i don't want to say it extremely works because uh, i was a little bit skeptical at first because at first i wasn't really noticing it so i did take it out and reprogram it and i redid the steps because i don't know if my car recognized it when i first did it so i had to take it out uh synced it back in you know because i was honestly i thought i was going to return it because i'm like i don't know if i see a difference but I, like I said, I do notice those extra power within those few gears. I, I just don't know, of course, how much actually horsepower, if it does do any far as added any, I don't know the true numbers unless you get like a dyno test or something like that, which I, of course, might get. <clears throat> so this is really going to be part one. So my next video I'm going to do probably within the next uh, day or two. I'm going to do um, some zero to 60 times, you know, and I'm going to record it and put it on and, and actually see if it made a difference. Uh, I didn't see countless of videos. I've done a little bit of research on um, other uh, performance chips that you plug inside the uh, port. And some people say that they don't see a difference. You know, they don't see anything. So I'm really trying to figure out if this brand, um, Chip Your Car, is really you know, backing their numbers up because they're saying that all these chips are tuned and they're designed specifically for your vehicle. So I want to know if that's true. But like I said, I, I, I'm kind of on the fence 
but I'm kind of being proven wrong a little bit because I am noticing those those extra little horsepower as far as within those gear ratios and the power band. I can feel that. I just don't know from a standstill yet as far as 0 to 60. I want to uh, do the whole 150 miles first and then see it. Then if my um, 0 to 60 uh, time changes or goes down, you know, I'm hoping to see if I could break the 5 range, you know. Um, you know, you know, maybe 5.8 seconds, 5.6, 5.7, high fives, you know, then I would know it for sure worked. Um, but I'm just, you know, I'm just going to give short updates within the next couple of days just to finish riding out the rest of the 150 miles. Like I said, it comes in this little box here. This is the stage three. The stage three gives, um, a hundred, uh, excuse me, 60 horse plus horsepower. Then they have like stage one, stage two, which is, uh, I think it's like, one is like 20 horsepower, the next is like 40, and uh, it's a little cheaper. Like the cheapest one started like 150, then it goes up. No, no, excuse me, the cheapest one started, I think like at maybe 60 bucks, 50 or 70 bucks, something like that. Then the next is like 150, then this one's like uh, 220, 230. Uh, so they have guaranteed numbers. Uh, and it, you know it has a lifetime warranty or a 30-day money back. So I just got it. So I'm, I'm programmed it in the vehicle. Um, and it's weird because when I first did it, it was like an error that popped up in my car. So I'm not sure if my car recognized the um, the chip was in there. But um, and that's why I said I had to re-sync it just to um, you know just to make sure it was working. And it was a few more things I had to get tweaked up just to make sure everything is I'm, my car is getting the full power that it needs um so once again my name is john gxp i'm just giving an update uh review actually a review on this ship your car and i will be giving a, a, a final update within the next couple of days on final numbers um and we'll go from there man see you soon